months with braces, what? <laughs> Brian's here. Anyway, <laughs> I'm so excited. Hey guys, it's Hazel. Welcome back to my channel. If you're not subscribed already, what are you doing? You see the problem? They're ruining my, my video. We are now heading to the orthodontist office. My orthodontist has been closed for two months since COVID. So I'm so excited to finally go. It's like technically I've had braces for eight, eight months, but the last time that I actually made progress, like my last progress video of me being in the orthodontist was my um, five going on to, I think it was five month braces update is the last time I was in the office. I also don't know if like they're gonna let me film, like they usually let me film, but I don't know if because of everything that's going on now and all the different procedures that they're taking if they're gonna be like no we don't want you to film or something hopefully they'll let me film you have to wear a mask and you can only go in one at a time so I can't bring like Caitlin or Ryan in with me to these appointments sorry if there's like noise we're driving I'm really excited there's really nothing to update you guys in regards to the progress of my teeth like they just been the same from the last time I filmed my six month braces update where I answered a bunch of questions. And yeah, so let's see what they do. Last time I was there, they said that they might put, um, might give me like elastics and rubber bands to put in myself, but I don't know if things are gonna change. And yeah, my wire in the back has been bothering me a lot. So I'm hoping that they change that. I'm gonna tell them too. So yeah, that's it. Anyways, I'll see you guys when we get to the office. I was gonna say my bottom wire on this side, um, this has been poking me a little bit. Okay. But that's it. Everything else. I was so happy because I was like, I have power chains, I have black power chains, I got I stuck with color. the right stuff. Yeah. You know? I stick with the black or do you want to change it? Um, can I see the colors? Yeah, I think I wanted to do light blue. It's removable. You remove it when you're brushing your teeth, mm -hmm. and if you're uncomfortable eating with them, take them off. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, you want to change them at least uh, three to four times a day. Mm -hmm. Okay. If you keep one rubber band in for the entire day, it's not going to give you that cold that we're looking for. Mm -hmm. So that's why I would say change it for breakfast, lunch, dinner. Okay. All right. So if they're ready, you can see through. Yeah. Okay. At the very back side, you see that hook that's on the very bottom? Uh huh. So you're gonna hook it on that hook there, and you're gonna hook it to here. Well, they pop, like, will they? They will pop. So let's just say you put it on now, right? And then uh -huh. a few hours from now is dinner time. You go to eat dinner. As soon as you open up your mouth to put something in, it's, it's gonna pop. You think it hurts, it really doesn't. Okay. <laughs> You just, as you're opening, you feel a pop and you're like, oh, my rubber band just broke. Uh -huh. so, so just to give you an idea on how rubber bands work overall, mm -hmm. it's like you taking a big ball and pushing it up the hill. Mm -hmm. so if you release that ball before you get to the hill, what happens to it? It's not going to go. It's just going to go right back down. Yeah. That's how these work. So if you have them in all day today and you forget to put them in tomorrow, mm -hmm. whatever progress you made today, you lost it. 
So these are gonna do what uh, again? The rubber band. So open up nice and low, and bite down again. So you see how your oh, no bite on your normal bite. There you go. You see how your canine is like right up against this canine here? Yeah. We need this canine to be in between these two. Okay. Now the reason why we're doing it is because we're closing this space now. Uh huh. This tooth here is gonna come forward uh -huh. little by little. Okay. At the same time, we need to keep this tooth coming back. Okay. This space here is going to start closing also. We're starting to pull here. Uh huh. And the same thing here. And the same thing here. Hi guys. So, why are my teeth look so white? So, Ryan just pranked me. He told me that he picked up some random girl with red hair. He's talking about Wendy's. He got us Wendy's. <laughs> um, but, so, a lot has changed. My teeth, I have rubber bands. And these are supposed to fix my bite as well as help close my gaps because they're gonna start closing them and I also they changed my wire so now I have a stainless steel wire you can see it's a lot different honestly it looks a lot less noticeable than the other wire I got light blue for my bands um, yeah honestly I'm just scared that they're gonna pop in my mouth and I don't really want it to be painful but she like taught me how to put them like how to have them on with the hooks and everything so hopefully they'll I won't have such a hard time I have to low-key take them out right now and put them back in to eat my nuggets she said I have to change them like three to four times a day I have to take them out when I brush my teeth or eat and then put them back in and things like that so it's gonna be like a lot of maintenance that I have to make sure I'm on top of because she said if I don't you know like do it they're gonna know one and also it's just gonna like ruin all the progress that I've made with them so yeah and she also said I'm probably gonna be sore for the next few days but yeah these are my teeth cute definitely not used to it kind of looks gross I feel like it makes me salivate a lot more too that is it for the braces vlog thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my channel if you want to be part of the family and if you want to keep updated with my braces journey then also if you're not subscribed what are you doing and yeah bye guys